Shalom all. This is Prophet Kiran Elijah from India Supernatural Life. I hope everyone is doing well by the grace of the living Jesus Christ. And today I want to share some of the great revelation that, that can glorify the living God, Jesus Christ. So actually, I'm going directly to the word of the Lord. Actually, the book of Genesis, chapter number 1, verse number 3. Uh, this scripture is familiar to everyone, I think so, because in the book of Genesis, everyone know the chapter number 1. Yeah, and verse number 3 that says, And God said, Let there be light, and there was light. When God said, so we all know this scripture. When God said, Let there be light, and there was light. So when God said that, Let there be light, when the God spoken the word, then the word will then the word was manifested. So when God said that let there be light and there was light. Okay, and verse number four, God saw that the light was good and he separated the light from the darkness. So I want everyone to understand that. God saw God saw that the light was good and he separated the light from the darkness. So when God, when God saw the light was good, the moment when God saw the light was good, then he separated the light from the darkness. So I want to give you the revelation regarding the verse number four. Everyone be active and I want everyone to pay attention for this scripture to be revealed. Because God said he separated the light from the darkness. He separated the light. He divided the light from the darkness so it means before we divide something it is a sign that that it is joined so for an example if i am if i want to divide if i want to divide something if i want to divide something before i am before i divide it it is already joined it is mixed so god is dividing uh, both god is dividing what the light from the darkness so before god divided light from the darkness it means both are mixed already so light and darkness are are joined so before god divided the light and darkness then it is joined it is mixed because of that reason god divided the two god divided the light and darkness before that it is joined so what is my question is how come we can say that how come we can say that uh, how come we can say that light and darkness is mixed light and darkness are in the same place for an example if we if we uh, if we own the power if we own the electricity then the light appears what gone then when the light appears then the darkness will disappear the moment light appears, the darkness disappears. The, the moment darkness appears, the light disappears. Actually, this is, this is the strategy of the light and darkness. But what the scripture is saying that God divided light. God divided light and the darkness. God divided light from the darkness. It means before that, it is mixed. Before that, it is mixed. So before that, it is being mixed. So I want everyone to notice this scripture so that you can understand it better way. I want everyone to pay attention for the word of the Lord, Gospel of John, chapter number 1 and verse number 2 and verse number 3. Everyone has to pay attention because we all know that uh, according to the Gospel of John, chapter number 1, verse number 3, uh, to him all things were made, without him nothing was made that has been made. And also, there is a chapter number four, sorry, chapter, uh, chapter number one, verse number four. In him was life, and that life was the light of all mankind. So in Jesus Christ, there is a life, but that life is the light for all mankind. Sun is not the light because when God, when God said, let there be light, in that time, there is no sun that can produce the light. Of course, we can see physically only the sun can produce the light. But before God created a sun, God created a light. 
before God created a sun and the moon and the stars, God spoke, God created a light. So what is that light? Because we all know that light comes from sun, light comes from moon, light comes from the stars. But we, we doesn't know how come God created a light before, how come God created a light before God created a sun and moon and stars. So we all know that the source of the light is a sun in the sky. But God, God, the scripture, God is created the light already without creating the sun. So what is that light? Here the gospel of John chapter number one, here the disciple John is speaking about the light. In him, in Jesus was life. And that life was the light of all mankind. In the Lord Jesus, there is a life. That life is the light for all mankind, for everyone who is breathing, for everyone who is breathing and, and living. That the, the life of the man is nothing but the light which is coming from the life of Jesus Christ. And also, verse number five, the light shines in the darkness and the darkness has not overcome it. So the light shines in the darkness. So there is a darkness. But we cannot see the darkness when light appears. But the darkness is existed. Understand everybody. So when, when light appears, then the darkness will disappear. That doesn't mean the darkness is just removed from that light. No, but there is a darkness. Because of that reason, God divided the light and darkness. But here yeah, the scripture was number five. The light shines in the darkness and the darkness has not overcome it. So this is very wonderful scriptural, my brother and sister. So, so, the, so the Apostle John is saying that there is, there is a light. So, sorry, uh, 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 John the Baptist is saying that there is a light that shines in the darkness and the darkness has not overcome it. So my brother, let us, let us go back to the scripture, Gospel of John chapter number, sorry, sorry, go, book of Genesis chapter number one and verse number four, that we can say that God saw that the light was good and he separated the light from the darkness. So what it mean? So I want everyone to keep notice. According to the Gospel of John chapter number one, there was a light. What, that, what was that light? The light is the life of Jesus Christ. The light is nothing but Jesus Christ according to the gospel of John chapter number one. What is that? The life is Jesus Christ. Okay, so the, so the light is Jesus Christ. So here, God said that let there be light. And there was light. Okay, so when there is a light and there is a darkness. There is a light and there is a darkness in the heaven. So who is the light? Light is Jesus Christ. Who is the darkness? Lucifer. Is the dark person Lucifer is the darkness Lucifer is the evil person so I want everyone to keep notice there are two lights in the heaven Lucifer is the light once upon a time Jesus Christ is the light forever but Lucifer is also a light once upon a time before he fallen from heaven he is the light he is the genuine light of God he is the true light of the Father but after the Lucifer made a mistake, it became the darkness. So once upon a time, two lights are joined together. Okay, these two lights, not darkness and not light, but the two lights, the Lucifer and Jesus Christ, it's at the same place, which is called as heaven. So the Lucifer, Jesus was at the same place. Lucifer and Jesus was at the same place because these people both are lights of God. But when Lucifer did a mistake, then he became what? Darkness. Okay, then he became the darkness. When the Lucifer became the darkness, then God decided to divide both. I already said earlier that God divided the light and darkness. Before God divided the light and darkness, it is joined. The light and darkness are joined. Because of that reason, God divided the both. So what I want everyone to uh, what I want everyone to keep attention is uh, when God created 
uh, when God divided the light and darkness before that there was a light and darkness being joined together nothing but Jesus and Lucifer was joined together when the Jesus and Lucifer joined together uh, nothing but the two are lights from God Jesus is the light and the Lucifer is the light once upon a time but when, G when, when Lucifer did a mistake then, it, then the Lucifer became the darkness so that God divided the both. I already said earlier that the, the light and darkness both are mixed. But what I'm trying to say, what I'm trying to understand that uh, the Lucifer is the light once upon a time. But when, when the Lucifer became the darkness, then God divided the both the light and darkness. Then it is done. So my brother, so when God, when God, created the sun before god created a sun in the sky god created a light light is nothing but the life of jesus christ the life of jesus christ is the nothing but the light of the father my brother i want everyone to keep notice on these scriptures so that you can understand it better way so everyone has to be understandable because of these words of the lord so i want these scriptures to be noticed by the power of the holy spirit and i hope everyone understand and why why light and darkness how how come the light and darkness uh, will be together so this is the true information that by the holy spirit by the inspiration of the holy ghost this is the true information that i can give you give give you my people of god so i hope everyone is blessed by the grace of the lord in jesus christ's name uh, I bless you in Jesus' name. Amen, amen, amen. God bless everyone.